I've had a lot of requests lately for different types of rigs. So I'm going to do a couple different videos. Uh, first one here, I'm going to do a snowman rig. Uh, very simple to do. I'm just going to show how I set mine up. And then we'll do some variations of it as well in other videos. I want to do a first person view like I do all my rig videos so it's easier to look at. I always felt when you're looking down at it in a video, it's kind of like you're hands on and it's easier to learn that way. Okay, to start off, uh, show you the products I'm going to be using for this. I'm going to be using a Corda Wide Gape number 4, Corda Entrap Soft 20 pound. I like the 20 pound, it seems like it's a good all around uh, coated hook link. Just need your scissors, of course. I uh, need a line stripper. I uh, need a, a stop, of course. And uh, I'm going to be using the uh, CC Moore Acid Pair Drops, 14 mil pop ups, along with the bottom part, which is going to be an 18 mil live system boilie. You want your bottom part to be bigger than the top part, hence the name Snowman. So let's go ahead and get started with this. First thing you do, open up your end trap. Just have to get some more here, I'm almost out. Okay, just uh, measure out a section, probably about a foot long. Go ahead and cut that. Oops, let me move back here there. About a foot long, go ahead and cut that off. Okay, what I'm going to do next is take the line stripper and whatever the hair part's going to be, we're going to go ahead and strip that off. So I'll go back about three and a half inches, I'd say. So all I did there, put in the stripper, pull the coating off, which you can see right here. Discard that. And then simply tie an overhand loop. This is basically like doing a hair rig, that's all. It's just how it's set up different. Do an overhand loop. I get my uh, needle. Make this a little bit easier on myself. Oops, loop popped out there. Let's do that again. Overhand loop. Come around. Sometimes it's easier with the baiting needle pull through. So I did that there. And we'll just cut off our tag end. Okay. Now usually I'll go ahead and start putting it on the hook. But what we want to do here is get a uh, bottom bait. So we got 18 mil live system. And then I'm going to be using a uh, acid pair drop 14 mil pop up from CC Moore. These just came out, so I'm going to start playing around with these. They're like a nice contrast between the two, so that's how our rig's going to look. So, the one that's going to go on top, put that on the needle first, slide it the whole way up, and then our bottom bait. So that way, once you put it onto the overhand loop, it'll slide down that way. So I could slide them down. And just gotta get a stop out here. Okay, put a stop through the top. And just pull everything down slowly. Okay, so we have our two baits set up, the pop-up on the top and the regular boilie on the bottom. Next thing you want to do is get out your hook. With 18 mil boilie, I usually use a size 4 or a size 6. It's really what you want to do. Okay, this part we're just doing a regular hair rig. So 
So they take her hook, go down through the eye, pull it up here. Now keep in mind when this sits on the bottom, it's going to be hovering like that. So just leave a gap about probably like about like that, about a half inch, and then pinch tight. Do our loops. Two, three, four. Five. I'm going to do six. Pinch it tight and pull back down through the eye. I just went through that fast so you can watch my hair rig video if you're not familiar with the hair rig. So basically right there we have our bait set up and I'm just going to do an overhand loop for the end part here. That way I can put on a quick link. I usually leave the coating on, it just seems to give a little bit more strength. Get the needle out again. And pull through. And just test it, just pull tight, just make sure that knot's good. Cut off the trim piece. Okay, I already have a lead, inline lead. And my usual setup here is I use a uh, ring swivel and then a quick link put together. It just gives more movement and I like that in the rig. So I could put that on. Okay, so we got everything set up. And let's go over to the tank and see how it looks. Okay, I'm just about to drop it down. You can see how the weight of the hook pulls it down, just hovering off the bottom. And there we go, there's our snowman rig. Very simple, extremely effective. Since everything is very buoyant now because of that pop-up, when a fish sucks everything in, um, the weight of the hook is going to dig deep in the lip. There we go, and we still have the lead weight to create the bolt effect. So another simple rig to learn. Not really too different than a hair rig, it's just all how you set it up, that's all. Thanks for watching.